غير المقبول عن الله سبحانه وتعالى في ذلك وما سوى مسلم الحمد لله رب العالمين والله لا إله إلا الله تسلم كم من أزكى مسلم يا أنت كم من أزكى مسلم أنا يا أمير سعيدين من إسرائيل لكن سرنا كم سجل ورد لي سرنا على أبي سعيد لا بس فيما Your Excellency, sir, on behalf of Sokoto State Government and the good people of Sokoto State, I warm you, welcome you to Sokoto State, the seat of the Caliphate. I must express my profound gratitude to you for your deep love you have for the good people of Sokoto State, our leaders, His Eminence, and my humble self, which inform your decision to pay us this historic cellar visit. Your Excellency, we thank you most sincerely. I'm also highly elated to be the first governor in our country, Nigeria, to host His Excellency on this historic visit. Your Excellency, distinguished audience. As we are all aware, this is the first visit of His ex official first visit of His Excellency, the Vice President of the Peru Republic of Nigeria. Sir, we thank you for your humility, courage, and tolerance at the issues of most serious challenges of our country. We thank you most sincerely. Once again, on behalf of Sokoto State Government and good people of Sokoto State, we welcome you to Sokoto and we pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to bless you, to give you more courage help to continue the good work you are doing to this country. Sir, as tradition, whenever we have an August visitor, we cannot allow him to just go back home like, just like that. But we have a special gift that we can give our visitors so that whenever you look at that gift, you can put in your mind and remember you have been to Sokoto, the seat of the Caliphate. We have a design leader work for the handcraft of Attics of Sokoto State. So I now have the privilege to present this to you and also present the one for my own mother at home so that <laughs> you can take it to her. Also remember that she has a son who is a governor in Sokoto State. Thank you very much, sir. Your Eminence, the Sultan of Sokoto, Al Hayasad Abakar Tad, Man I and the President General, Nigerians for the Council of Islamic Affairs in Nigeria. Today, in this great palace, I have the privilege and the honor to formally introduce to you your own, His Excellency, Senator, Kashim Shatima, the Vice President 
of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. And to hear from him the purpose of his visit. Your Excellency, sir, you are most welcome to this great palace. On behalf of our delegation, I wish to register our most profound gratitude to His Excellency, the Governor of Sokoto State, and our leader, the Serkin Yemma, distinguished Senator Aliu Magatakar Dawamako, for the warm reception and enthusiastic welcome accorded us during this uh, brief visit to Sokoto. Fundamentally, we are here to greet our leaders as the Sultan and pay the usual Salah homage. <laughs> I will urge the governor to maintain his humility and provide leadership to our people. Most importantly, I will urge you to nurture and sustain your relationship with the Serkin Yama Senator Ali Magatakaza Wamako. Be wary, be suspicious of the mischief mongers who will always try to sow seed of discord between our leaders. And you can learn a lot from my boss, Professor. Babagana Umara Zulum, with whom I have the best of relationship over the years. I will ask you, I will employ you, I will beg you in the name of Allah to at whatever cost sustain your relationship with the Serkin Yemma for the peace, stability, and progress of our sub region. Please accept the glad tidings and regards from His Excellency, President Bola Ahmed Tinibu. He's very much aware of the challenges of our people. The insecurity that has pervaded the northwest region of the country is taking power reaching measures. And I want to congratulate you in the past 30 days, there have been some semblance of peace. Out of the four terrorist leaders, I think the security forces have adequately handled three of them. I want to commend them. We want to thank them for all the sacrifices they have made and continue to make for peace to envelop this part of the world. There can never be peace without development, and there can never be development without peace. I want to urge our political leaders to unite as a people to confront our common challenges of insecurity, poverty, and underdevelopment. From the bottom of my heart. Salaamu Alaikum wa Rahmatullah. Salaamu Alaikum wa Rahmatullah wa Barakatuta. Your Eminence, I am here at the behest of President Bola Ahmed Tinibu to specially come to Sokoto and convey his Salah greetings and best wishes to His Eminence, the Sultan of Sokoto, the leader of the Ummah in Nigeria in this auspicious time of Eid al-Kabir Salah Festival. Munzoni Munkao Gaiswam Bangirma Dane Mantabarraki Awajang May Martaba Allah Kara Salki Lapia La Dogon Kwana Munzomu Masubiyani your eminence, inshallah, who is a man 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 
arewa muna cikin masala ga rashin zaman lafiya ga talauci ya cancanta mu hada kai muga inda dare yayi mana wasira shine na kira shi gwamna akan koyaya zai kar ya bari baraka ya shiga sakanin sa da senator Aliyu maga takarda wa mako kuma kar ya bari ya girma ma sarki ya mutunta sarki don sultan of sokoto is an institution not only in northern nigeria but in the west african sub region in the muslim world there can never be peace without development there can never be development without peace it's cheaper for him to maintain his relationship with sir kiyama than to fight him it's a force of nature it's cheaper for him to maintain his relationship with the sultanate muhada kai abinda hadin kai bai yi mana ba rashin hadin kai ba zai taba cin mana ba ina godiya ga his eminence ina godiya ga gwamnatin mu ina godiya ga shugaban mu shi shugaba ne ba a Sokoto ba shi shugaba ne a Arewa shi shugaba ne a Northwest muna girma ma shi muna martaba shi ke datijo ne Allah ya baka sa zaman lafiya Allah ya kara sarki lafiya assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa rana teo rana ta jumwa rana mai dimbin albarka a gare mu muslimi har ma wanda ba muslimi ba muna cike da farin ciki da ƙara gode ma Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala da ya kawo dan uwan mu abokin mu kuma shugaban mu a wannan kasata mu Najeriya mutum ke shugaban kasa ya kawo shi gida domin wannan ziyara ta karfa zumunci da neman lada ta barka da sallah sallar da muka yi ɗan kwanaki da sakoce alhamdulillah muna cike da farin ciki irin wannan ziyara tana ƙara ƙarfa mana guyuwa kuma ƙara taimaka mana mu ƙara daure da mara wajen ayyukan ƙasar mu Najeriya da kuma ayyukan al'umma musamman al'umma muslimi muna ƙara gode mallam Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala da ya kawo ku lafiya kuma muna roƙon sa ya maida ku gida lafiya ba lokacin da mangannu bane ko dogayen jawabai ba domin wannan zuwa bai zuwa ce ta barka da sallah kuma nuna muhimmancin zumunci tsakanin mu musamman ba ma kasar ba daular usmaniya ba da kasar bonno ba da daular bonno ba duk wa san me tsakanin mu a tarihance mu amin muna da aminci mai ƙarfi wanda ba wanda ya siyara ba mu muna cikin farin jima ga cewa ga shi mataimakin shugaban kasa ya zama na farko da ya sa mana matsayi da gwantan bangare mu na mun yi shugabancin lokacin shehu shagari to ga Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala ya kawo wani kuma ya kawo gwamnati da kanshi yace sai ya biyo gida ya rako shi domin shi ma ya samu cikakken lada kuma wala da muke neman mu samu ita ce ma mu zauna mai juma'a tare mai sallar juma'a tare mu ƙara addu'o'i domin kasar mu samu cigaba mai girma mutum ga shugaba muna cike da godiya muna baka tabbas da gwamnatin tarayya ba da cikakken hadin kai wajen aikin da kuke yi kuma cikin kan goyon baya musamman na musulmi da kuma sauran sarakunan kasar nan wannan ke shugabanci insha Allah za mu ba ku cikin goyon baya don a samu cigaba a samu zaman lafiya like you said no peace without development no development without peace we know that and i think it's what we should continue telling each other we need peace and why we need peace we have to also take active issues Today is exactly a month since you are sworn in. 
exactly a month since you are sworn in, and you have done a lot within a month. I think it's something that we need to acknowledge. Some issues are so bad to some people, but we must take decision. It's better take decision than not take any at all. And I think some decision taken will see the benefits later on. So we need to conform with the normal standard of reaching out to everybody. Communication is very important. We are here as your communicators. We discuss, we go and tell people what things are. Policies are important. Some stringent policies are important for us to move forward. But I believe we must always take people along so that everybody knows what we are doing, why we are doing it. And at the end of it, when things are better, people will say, Alhamdulillah, we suffered before, but now we are much better. We will support you 100%, inshallah. We will give you our awards at any time. Uh, you reach out to us or you don't reach out to us. Inshallah, we will support the government and we will do whatever it takes to maintain peace and stability in our states, in our country, Nigeria. The Kazo Lafia, Lavanta Alla made a Kulafia, Muna Chek, Muna de Gumuna, the French, Muna Chek, the French, the Gordia, the one down Ziara, the Karapo Zumunch, the Kanimo, Malhamdulahi, one number Karemi Abu Naba, Munda Kabia, Mutumba Adua, Muna Aramaka Adua, Lassa Soko and Noe, much Kim Nasara, Alla Bamu Lafia, Samo Nigeria, Bamu Zaman Lafia, Bamu Chigaba. We are given a very warm reception and enthusiastic welcome by the governor and the senator representing Sokoto North. Uh, the rest assured that the government will take all measures to safeguard the lives and properties of the city government and create opportunities for our youth to begin to be employed. Thank you. Thank you so much.